Come here, Oreo. Bring your frisbee. Good girl. Hey, what's up guys? I'm outside today working on the Malibu. I'm gonna get it cleaned out, figure out what I really got to work with here. And I'm gonna pull out the AC and heater box because I just don't need it. So, let's take a look at this car and see what we got. Got the hood taken off of it, sitting over here. And uh, there's a bunch of stuff in here. Screwdriver, here's some good hoses. And some miscellaneous parts over here. A chain. Very short chain. I don't know what I could do with that. There's a funnel there. The AC box I'm going to get rid of. And a lot of that wiring is going to go also. That's trash. Uh, I got the new fender right here. You can see how beat up this one is. But I actually like the beat up one. Since I do want to do a sleeper build. I think the beat up fender looks good on here. The fender is the only damage to this car, body wise. Need to clean this thing out. Take that shifter out and put my shifter in. Got an extra back glass. There's an extra cowling right there for the front end. Because that one's got some cracks in it. But that's okay. And then uh, back here. I really hope that price was when this car had a motor in it. Back here is where the spare tire is supposed to go. But uh, I think I'm going to put my nitrous bottle in here. There's more than enough room for it. So I think that'd be really cool. Keep up with the uh, the sleeper look. Keep the stock interior. Now I'm thinking about getting some rally wheels for it because uh, my fancy ones there they're a little too racy looking for the theme that I want to go with. Those are the front runners off of the rat rod over there because my fatties off the S10 which are in the garage didn't fit. They hit the frame rail so I'm going to have to cut the frame and notch it. Not a big deal. And they're sitting right here. The, uh, the motor and transmission out of the S10's right there. Uh, I got a bunch of the components in that uh, locker right there, that cabinet. The nitrous bottle is up there on the shelf. So all the good parts I kept out of the S10 are going to go into this car. Uh, the MSD 6AL2 ignition, the motor, transmission, the shifter, nitrous kit. And for now, the wheels and tires. But later I might go with some rally wheels. Uh, but it's a pretty clean looking car. Uh, so let's get started getting it cleaned out and get this AC box removed. Alright, I'm starting the back of the car. Clean this out first because this is where I'm going to put parts of the car. Bolt. Those are valve cover bolts. Here's a piece of trim which I'm going to leave back here. mat another for sale sign oh, man. Spanish music and then some speaker wire that I can cut out oh, what's in there? more speaker wire
Usually I'm excited about cleaning a car out that I get, but I don't think I'm going to find anything good in the car. heavier than it looks. The door panel. Another door panel. A steering wheel cover. It has definitely seen better days, but at least it's a Chevy one. That's trash though. parts for the front of the car, but this one's broken, so I don't know if that's any better than what's on there or not, but I'll keep it anyway. Actually, I need it for the same side. I need it for the driver's side. Okay. Oh, check this out. The speaker grill covers, they go on the dashboard. I had no idea they were made of metal. That's pretty cool. Now, unfortunately, when I got this car, I wasn't really able to look underneath it. So I've kind of run into a, a small problem here, not a big deal. A little bit of rust on the floor. Probably from water sitting. This is a Texas car, so I don't plan on finding a lot of rust. But by the looks of the carpet, there's been a lot of water sitting here. But the seat is actually in really good condition. It's just dirty. Clean this thing up, it should look brand new, or at least close enough. Let's see what's down here under the seat. What is that? Oh, the ashtray. <laughs> With a piece of paper in it. It's a, a bank check. Um, 2017. Interesting. The guy did say this car was someone's daily driver with a 3 3 in it. Yeah. That's nasty. I can throw this in the back with the rest of the parts for the car. I'm gonna throw that nasty stuff away. There's some more stuff under the seat. Parking garage ticket, it looks like. The clutch pedal pad. All right, let's move to the front. Okay, it looks like just trash up here. That's a uh, door handle to one of the doors. Maybe they already replaced it, because I don't see a broken one on the car. That's the temperature lead for the gauges. Uh, that's trash. Here's the passenger side wiper blade. I don't know why they took it off. Here's a phone charging cord. An oil dipstick tube. And then over here, uh, the guy told me that the oil line for the gauge had broke and sprayed a bunch of oil in there so that's why that's like that so a yeah, cool fact about this car that I kind of just learned is that you see how there's three pedals right there this car had a standard transmission in it at one point probably when it was new and then under the hood That's the clutch link interage right there. So it looks like it had a mechanical clutch on it. That's pretty interesting. I need to look up the VIN number and see what motor came in this car. Keep on uh, cleaning here. Throwing 
out of this stuff away. I need to clean the battery tray. Probably paint it. It's got some rust in it. That's trash. Hey Oreo. And the rest of the stuff I'll just throw in the hardware drawer in the toolbox and keep it. And then my next goal is to get the AC box torn out and the AC condenser and clean up this wiring and then patch the hole where the AC box was. Alright, so that's it for this video guys. Sorry it's been so boring for the past two or three videos, but uh, once I get all this boring stuff taken care of and parts start showing up then we can start having fun throw the motor in there notch the frame put some fat slicks on the back add a nitrous bottle and go play have some fun do some burnouts donuts all that other good stuff so that's it thanks for watching please like share comment subscribe and i'll see y'all next time